Hi guys, welcome back to Glass and Sparkle. So what I have for you today is a review on a new jewelry subscription box. This is actually based on a request I got from a subscriber. She wanted to know if I had ever heard of Emma and Chloe, which I had not, and she was thinking about buying them, but she was wanting to see a review first. So I decided to go ahead and do this review, so this is for you. So in case you've never heard of it, Emma and Chloe is the first French jewelry subscription box. What I love about this is that it's so customizable. It seems like every subscription service has a quiz that you have to take. Do I like gold? Do I like silver? Do I like earrings and rings? But this is the only one that I've ever been subscribed to that asked, do you have pierced ears? And I don't. So I was so appreciative that I could put, no, I do not have pierced ears, but I love earrings. So you will see what I got. So the boxes are absolutely beautiful. They look like this. They almost appear to be like a book. And I don't know, I just feel like these are so, so nice. Packaging really does a lot for me, as we all know. But I really, really like this. And it opens up just like a book, just like this. And look at that, isn't that nice? So the first thing you're gonna see in here that caught my eye was this. Um, Le Gazette and basically it's a magazine showcasing a lot of their jewelry and just a lot about fashion It's really really nice and well made. I really like this then the goods your jewelry so It comes in a cute little dust bag like this and then inside you will see a certificate of authenticity I hope that's not too bright but you're going to see a certificate of authenticity. In particular, this is because I received the Munin necklace. It says this certificate states that the necklaces Munin are plated with gold or dip coated in a silver bath. And then it tells you how to take care of your piece. So the funny thing is that when I saw the magazine, because that's what I looked at first, I saw the necklace that she had on. I was like, oh, I want that necklace. And lo and behold, that was in fact the Munin necklace. I love this so, so much. I love layered necklaces, but this is just so beautiful. It has this beautiful gold bar at the bottom. So these little beads I was confused about. I was like, what, what are these? I don't understand why they would just add those. But they're actually lapis lazuli, if you've ever heard of that stone. And my husband was pretty excited about that because he plays Minecraft. And I guess that's one of the building properties that you can use on there. So he was like, wow, lapis lazuli, that's amazing. So yes, I'm really, really liking this. And that was the first piece that I tried. So the next item that I received from them were in fact some earrings and I'm wearing them today. They're like an art deco kind of mod looking earring. I just think they're absolutely beautiful and I just love them. It was really hard for me not to wear these before the review, but I really didn't want to until I, I don't know, I posted this, but they're so, so pretty. I'm loving them and they are very, um, I don't know how to explain it. You know how sometimes clip-on earrings won't stay on? These definitely stay on, and I just love them. They're so beautiful. So you're probably wondering about the price. The price of this box is $35, and in each box per month, you're going to get a piece valued at $50 to $200. So this particular necklace, the Munin necklace, was valued at one am I covering it up, was valued at $115 is the retail price. So a super good deal. So this review is not sponsored, obviously. They did send these for a review, but I just thought I'd share them with you because I'm really, really liking them. And also, they were kind enough to provide a coupon code for my viewers. So if you guys want to get a Emma and Chloe box for yourself, use the code GLOSS50. I will put it right here, GLOSS50 for 50% off your first box. So I hope you guys take advantage of that code to get yourself 50% off a beautiful subscription box. Now, just a note, something that I would like to tell you about it is that if you're expecting to get like a big old bobbly statement necklace in here, like that looks like it came from like Claire's or something, that's not what this is. These are for very, I don't know, I want to say like dainty, understated, but beautiful, elegant pieces that, you know, are classic of French jewelry. So, yeah, if you're looking for something like that, then definitely check it out. So thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!